Today is pretty, pretty gloomy. This is July 11th, Thursday morning. I don't know what it is, but I really love the way, after a little rain, how the sky looks, the mood that it communicates. It's just a real nice look. It's been, what, about a month and a little bit of change since we've gotten this place. I've been coming here every day, just coming here to go in my office and to do some work, do some editing. A lot of time, I'm just kind of sitting there. There's like nothing in here, nothing at all. It's just like an empty space, and it's it's cool, but it's annoying at the same time. Like. This is like kind of like trash. This just books in here. So all it has to do is books. Just look at all of this. It's just books. We got a huge 65 inch. Uh, I don't know. It kind of looks like it could be too big for the wall, but given the space. It, it, like, it looks pretty good. Like, if I want to sit back here, I'm sitting right here. The dining table is supposed to be here. Just watch here. It'll be good. Before I show you guys the office, I wanted to I wanted to talk about why I even have an office. There are many tropes that I see like YouTubers go through many phases. First they start with the iPhones or any kind of smartphone, then they get the SLR cameras. And you know there's a, that's a similar progression you see a lot of the time. What you also see changes from recording in a room to recording in an office and sometimes even going to an office space like Casey Neistat and Peter McKinnon. Now to me, right, I do things because I want to do them. You know what I mean? Like I saw the natural progression of typical YouTubers, just like you see the progression of a typical barber where they start like in their house or they go into a barber shop and then sometimes people get their own shop and things like that. I never guessed, first of all, this echo in here is unbelievably annoying. Hold on, if I open up this door one time. Oh crap. Even though it's hot as hell. Super hot, super hot. I'm gonna stay right here. The more I do things, the more I improve, the more I try and get better on here and just in life is the more it kind of demanded it for me. It's like I said in one of my previous videos, me and my wife's bedroom, and then I'm editing at the dinner table. It's just, I was all over the place. I had my hard drives and the couch, and I recorded a whole class in a bedroom, you know? I just wanted my own space so that I can take things to the next level. I found myself feeling restricted, like, like being discouraged from doing certain projects, being discouraged from doing a video or even doing another course or you know, something like that. I felt like in order for me to produce more, I wanted to be in a space that was conducive to producing and inspired me to do even more. Like, I mean, it's pretty empty in here, so it's pretty hard to make it messy, but this is definitely not the vision I have for it. Right here, if you look right here, this was actually a closet. There's like a mirror there. We took those out, basically my workspace right here, but I wasn't sure if I wanted it here or by the window. I had it on this wall initially, and it was dope because the window came out, but it stops here, and now it's a dark in the closet. 
so I need some light for this. This is my overhead rig. I think it's extra dope on some unbox therapy stuff. I'll be doing a whole bunch of gear stuff and oh, what's that? What is that? Got tripods, lighting stands, mic stands, and this light right here, the light dome too. This is what's gonna make some great videos, great lighting, great soft shadows. Let me turn this up a little. The vision is to have some sort of shelving here. I wanna really utilize the vertical real estate that we don't have much stuff on the floor. I can you know, do my recording and stuff. Yeah, that's what we have so far. That's what we got going on. Oh, actually something just came in the pack in the mail from Amazon to fix that problem. That's right above my head. I uh, was trying to use that, but there is so much echo. Basically what's in this box is lighting for the back of my computer. You see in the closet, it's really dark. So I needed some lighting to just spruce up the place a little bit. Coolest thing about these lights is that they can change colors. <music> change the color so I'm stuck with this color until I can do something about it it's very very unfortunate I was super excited to try this out have different colors now I gotta get random little knickknacks that I didn't know I had to get <sighs> it's very very anticlimactic I don't know if um, for all you guys seen Kevin Hart stand up but like this right here be a perfect, perfect gun compartment. Even though it's been a bummer, it doesn't look that bad. You know, the, the space is getting, the space is coming together. Uh, I ordered it online from Amazon, so that means during this pandemic, it's gonna take a good 27 years to get here. <laughs> but looking at this, I have some ideas. Like I can like put a strip along, like along the edge of this. That'd be extremely dope. I was in the house for three hours by myself, acting out shit that never happened. Oh, oh, shit, oh, shit. This how you gonna do me, huh? You gonna rob me at the front door? Okay, okay. I'm gonna give you what you want. I'm gonna give you what you want. Just let me check the mailbox one last time. Gun compartment. <laughs> <laughs> 